What's going on, guys? It's King Bell here. Subscribe, leave a comment, share the video. Uh, Patreon link in the description if you would like to support the channel. <coughs> Twitter in the description. Follow the Twitter. Follow the Twitter. Retweet all the tweets. Uh, follow the Instagram. Follow the Instagram. And correct Ledger Nano S link in the description. Watch video to the end. Let's get into it. Leave a comment. So, now... A bank in uh in Ukraine, right? A bank in Ukraine is basic basically highlighting that Stellar can deliver <coughs> humanitarian aid. And we already know what humanitarian aid is, right? So they're basically saying that Stellar has great advantages. Okay, that how it transfers seamlessly and how it can be used in in the new financial system. But the main um, thing that they're saying, right, it's called Tuscombe Bank. It starts with a, with a T. It's a weird name, a bank. And that same bank in Ukraine actually cut cut the use for Stellar in multiple uh, other commercial banks around, you know, Ukraine, basically saying that the central bank is was going to be the ones delivering the uh, humanitarian uh, 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 aid, basically. So right now, at this point, the, they're getting ready to deliver the, the 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 humanitarian aid to the people in the Ukraine. Now let me tell you what's going to happen. Just like how I how I always say what's going to happen before a lot of new people came out that think they're saying something when they're really not because I already said it 2 years ago. 2 years ago. Okay? So this was going to happen. They're going to start to deliver the humanitarian aid, right? With you know over there in Ukraine with Stellar. And then they're going to start to realize, "Hey, you know what? We can deliver humanitarian aid all over the world. Right? But the main one is going to be XRP that does this. So they're going to start it over there in Ukraine and then it's going to get delivered all over the world. And some, well, XLM is going to deliver some humanitarian aid, you know, Ukraine, a few other countries, but the main one is going to be XRP, right? And then some people want to come out here and say, oh, Stellar is not a part of the ISO. Well, oh, it's not a, it's not a body member. If it's not a body member, then why the hell is it delivering humanitarian aid? It's a body member through IBM. See, people don't know crap. So basically, uh, it was something here that I want to share real quick. Okay, this was an important part. The research confirmed the readiness of the bank's infrastructure to integrate with blockchain solutions and provide an appropriate level of financial services using virtual assets. Okay? Taking into account all regulatory requirements. Okay? An executive for the Ukrainian financial entity went as far to dub the resulting use cases as drivers of transformation of the financial landscape in Ukraine. Well, they mean, obviously, financial landscape of the whole world. Because we saw the stellar um, <coughs> advertisement. I showed it to everybody. The stellar advertisement inside the, um, what was it, inside the newspaper? They could provide humanitarian aid. That means the whole world. So now they're getting ready to just implement it and start giving help through Stellar in Ukraine. And this will trickle down throughout the whole world because the whole entire world is completely screwed and there's no liquidity. So yeah, peace out.